Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to speak to you about multiple sclerosis, the monster. MS is a debilitating disease that impacts the brain and the spinal cord that makes up the central nervous system and controls everything we do. March is MS Awareness Month that is indicated by orange ribbons with a butterfly symbol representing the shape commonly seen on the MRI scans of an MS patient's brain. I am an MS warrior and today I will show you how I crocheted the MS Awareness ribbon during a MS exacerbation. So let's get started. You may select any color yarn that you need, but I am choosing orange because I am a MS warrior and this is MS Awareness Month. I am using a hook size G. You can pick whatever hook you need that's according to the yarn. Darning needle and scissors are needed as well. We're gonna start off by doing a slip knot to your hook and followed by a chain of 35. Now we've come back around and what we're going to do is go into the second chain from the hook and place in a single crochet. This is going to be your pattern for this round. So in each and every chain from this spot forward, you are going to put in a single crochet in each and every chain down the row. You have approached the end of the row. You should now have a total of 34 single crochets down the chain. Once you have completed your 34 single crochets, you're going to chain one and then turn your work. Next, we are going to do six single crochets. That's going to be a single crochet in the next six chains. Next, you're going to do three chains. Then you're going to skip three chains. In that fourth chain, all the way to the end, you're going to put in a single crochet in each and every chain down the row, which will give you a total of 25 single crochets from the time you skipped the three chains. This is a really easy pattern. However, when you're dealing with multiple sclerosis, it depends on the symptoms. It could be a really strenuous task. I had a struggle with this pattern only because of the numbness in my right hand. And I am a right-handed person. And there you have it. What you're going to do is chain one and then cut your yarn. Once you cut your yarn, 
you're going to pull out that handy dandy darning needle and sew in your ends. And now that we have tapered and sewn in all of the ends, you can now use this slit here to actually feed in one end of your ribbon or your yarn to form this awareness ribbon, especially the orange one for multiple sclerosis. And I appreciate you guys hanging in there with me today. It was tight and it was a little struggle, but I fought through it as I always do as an MS warrior. I want to thank you so much for joining me today. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell so that you are notified of all my videos when they're uploaded. Share me out because sharing is caring. And just remember, I have MS, but MS don't have me. I walk the walk and I am blessed. I walk the walk and I am blessed. See you next time. Love you long time. Bye-bye for now.